The Bristol Community Garden and the Bristol Community Food Pantry have partnered together to bring more resources to their city. The idea of the garden is that anybody that wants vegetables can come and get them as long as they just come and help tend the garden. And then at the end of each week, or on Wednesdays, sorry, um, any excess produce we'd have, we'd harvest that and we'd bring it here to the Bristol Pantry and they'd give this out with their distribution. Chris Garner, executive director of the pantry, shares the value of the garden. Produce is, is like really prized for us and for our families that come in because the fresh produce is not something that we readily have or maybe afford and so when we get that in that is something that is one it's a healthier nutrition level for our families as well as kind of, of something we love to have more of. This year the garden is expanding its size to provide more organic vegetables says Michael Ropp town is running water to it for us so we're going to expand the size of the garden it's going to be twice as big so we're going to have five 50 foot rows now that'll also allow us to increase our production of greens and lettuces which we just had a little bit of last year this year we're coordinating more with the pantry based on their needs so the partnership last year i think it, with a very small garden we did like 125 pounds to us we're anticipating at least twice that maybe three times that this year and being able to expand what we offer our families the Bristol Food Pantry is grateful for any donations the community can supply. So we um, service mainly Bristol and Washington Township, and we run about 100 families a month. We're really kind of focused on our backyard community, but we really depend a majority of what we do on our donations. The commitment to their community is mutual. I, I want to make the garden available for educational programs, um, really anything anybody wants to use it for. We want to make it available. There are neighbors and that that message goes through. It hits home, especially with our churches, but with so many people. These are my neighbors. These are people next door. We have watched actually people shift to coming on Saturdays versus other time slots now to be at breakfast and to shop. The desires of the garden and the pantry are to develop supportive resources for their neighbors. Our measure of success isn't numbers. Our measure of success is it's always been about how do we walk with people. Bristol's garden is a small piece of a much larger network of gardens that is supporting food pantries and communities in Indiana. For more information, visit feedindiana.org. Reporting for Globe News, this is Gabriella Klofenstein.